fresh nigga, A figure, that's my type. That's my type, nigga, that's my The real question is, what wig? <laughs> so today I will be showing you guys this unit that I got from Eunice Hair. It is a headband wig. This is the first headband wig I've ever tried and honestly it was amazing. Like it is a go-to. So right now I'm just unpackaging the box and I'm showing you guys everything that I received. So they had this little like goodie bag. So inside the bag, I received a wig cap. I also got a headband that had their logo on it. They gave me some nail art. I've never seen this before. But I also received some eyelashes, which is always great. And I got about four headbands. Five, including the one that came inside the package with the wigs so you have options and I also received this glittery headband this was like a charm bracelet or anklet but here is the wig guys this is the wig so let me show you guys exactly how this looks it was a curly wig I believe it was 28 inches 26 or 28 inches and this was a deep wave wig so inside the wig it had four clips it had one at the front one at the back and two at the sides it had an adjustable elastic and also this band that you use to tie around your head to secure the wig. So I'm starting off by combing my hair back and just brushing out my baby hairs because I will be having baby hairs at the front. So once I've taken out all the hair I'm going to use for my baby hairs, I'm just going to comb my hair back and catch it up with a clip because I will be using the stocking cap to hold my hair up. I will be going in with my famous Evan Edge Control to lay down my edges. Guys, you already know what time it is. So, yeah, just watch me work for a bit.
So I'm just moving the stocking cap back a bit to brush back in the longer pieces. That way it's not left out, so I'm just sticking them underneath the cap. Okay guys, so now I'm about to put on this wig like it's easy just like that. There's a comb at the back that I'm going to stick underneath my wig cap as you can see. And then I'm just going to pull the wig forward and I'm going to make it lay on the top of where the wig cap is. That's how far the wig is going to come up. And I'm just going to attach it at the back like it's simple just like that literally just attach the back it's like a velcro you literally lay it on top of one another and that's it after that's done you just put on one of the headbands that they gave you or you can use one of your own headbands you can use a scarf anything you want to put on top of the band you can use so I'm just gonna go ahead and wet the hair just a bit like it wasn't drenched it was just wet a bit So I decided to go in with the black headband that they gave me. I see a lot of people wearing them. I've never worn one before. So I decided why not. So I'm using this black headband. I'm just playing around with the hair, seeing how it looks, having it to the side, all back, you know, trying it out. So I'm going in with this Wave Nouveau. Um, it's a lotion, a curl lotion that I use in my curly hair. So I'm taking a good amount just because there is a lot of curls and I'm just going to apply it in the hair all over just to tame the curls a bit. I feel like it gives it more of a shine, it makes it lay more flat. It just gives it a look that I like. So that's what I'm doing now and this is basically it guys this is how it looks this wig is so simple it's such a go-to anytime you don't have time to do your hair you can literally throw this wig on no problem it looks natural it's like one of those half wigs that we used to do back in the day like do you guys remember those half wigs that's basically what it's like so guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to check out Uni's hair. This half wig, headband wig, I don't know what you guys want to call it. It's a headband wig, but I mean, you know. Don't forget to check them out. All the details will be down in my description box below. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll be back with another video. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button below, hit that like button, and yeah, leave a comment. Let me know what styles you guys would like to see me do next. Don't forget to follow me on my social medias at nay.simone, and I'll be back.